Today, my loyal and faithful followers and those who are just experiencing it for the first time, the word of the day is hypocrite. I see them everywhere. I see people who say one thing and do exactly the opposite. They say, well, I'm not into it for a relationship, but yet they're out there trying to date women. Or they say they're lonely, but they're bedding a woman every other night. Different woman every other night. Or you have those who aren't willing to go beyond their means, but I tell you what, you get a half a beer in them and they're ready to go. They're not even drunk. And you got people who say they're all about family, but yet they don't include you when you are part of the family. Such as being the father, and you're not being included, but yet the mother is not including you with the children, but she encourages family. Hypocrite. I dislike hypocrites. They say you're your friend, but they stab you in the back. Well, here's a little rant for you dirty motherfuckers. Go fuck yourself. Don't fucking talk to me. Don't come fucking near me. I don't want to be around your dirty, cheating, sniveling asses. I don't. Not even fucking close. Go blow it out your fucking ass. Go fly a fucking flag some fucking place else. This freak is flying his fucking flag right here. And here's how this goes down. If you're going to tell me you're a vegetarian, do it, love it, have it. Don't rub it in my fucking face. If you say you're gay or a lesbian, great. I don't want to see, well, unless you're really fucking cute, you know, I, I have no problem with that, but you know, uh, women, of course. I wasn't in prison that goddamn long. Twisted fucking minds. But, you know, I don't want to see it. I don't want you to rub it in my face. And they're talking about, I remember when the law got changed where you could, you know, gays and lesbians could get married. Well, you know what? Great. Don't rub it in my face. I don't want to hear about it. If you're going to do it, rub it in my face, you better be running for that fucking marriage license. I'm not going to do it because I'm going to mess up my credit score of my significant other. I don't fucking care. You love them, right? So what's the fucking matter with the credit score? The two credit scores will make no fucking difference, and there's ways around that, too. But they don't see it that way. They see it as a whole other way. So, I look at it like this. Two-faced motherfuckers, shut up. And I haven't had anything recent happen to me. It's just the fact I get tired of hypocrisy. You know, you say one thing that you're experiencing something, but yet you're not, and then you try to really show somebody up. Well, here's the deal. Uh, clearly you're not. All right. I'm good at a few things. I'm not going to say what they are, so I'm not judged on them. But I will tell you what I am good at. And that's ranting. I ain't the best, I ain't the worst. I'm somewhere towards the bottom end, but I'm alright. I'm okay with it. So, the next time you're sitting there and you see somebody, like in prison, this is the perfect example here in prison, that these masculine motherfuckers puffing their chest out, wearing the wife beaters that are too fucking tight, which is the opposite of the other end, which is where they wear the shit too big. They're wearing everything tight. They're wearing sweatpants, and they're pulling their fucking sweatpants up, and they're shaving their fucking legs. They're rolling their socks down so you can see their fucking ankles and the tennis shoes, and yet they're straight. Oh, sweetie, just give it up because you're not straight. You are a flamer. Jesus fucking Christ. Same guys are sucking dick in the shower at 2 o'clock in the morning. Blowing somebody else. Because you know what? That's how it is. You go so far one direction and you're a fucking hypocrite. Oh, I don't do that. I'm, this dick's women only. You know, it doesn't make any difference. Because you're still getting... You're still blowing some dude in the fucking shower. You're still taking the ass. I... I'm like a dog chasing cars. I want to go. Which makes me a hypocrite. Because I am burned out. But I still crave it. And I can admit it. Which doesn't make me a hypocrite. So there you go. If you can admit it, then you no longer are. So, if you're a dick, admit it you're a dick. If you're paying the ass, admit you're paying the ass. Most importantly, be the fuck you are. Quit being a fucking hypocrite. 
but saying one thing and doing exactly the opposite. So if you're a fucking vegan, don't be sneaking no fucking 69 cent fucking cheeseburgers from McDonald's. I don't want to hear about it. But you know what? You ain't a vegetarian. You ain't a vegan. And lastly here, ladies and gentlemen, that whole, I'm a God's person, a Bible thumper. I believe in Jesus Christ. What would Jesus do? Well, I'll tell you what would Jesus do. He'd shut the fuck up. And he'd start doing some actions. And then he'd talk about the actions he did. And then he would follow those same fucking actions he did. Because that's what Jesus would do. Jesus wouldn't be running his fucking mouth about the things he's going to do, the things he hath done, the things, everything. No. no. Nowhere near that, lads. Nowhere near that, losses. Because that's not what Jesus would do. So don't bring him into it. Because, frankly, well, if we're going to go to religion, well, then I have one thing to say to you. If you are a Christian, there's only one Christian religion that came first, and that's Catholicism. It is the first Christian religion. Every other Christian religion traces itself back to Catholicism. And Catholicism itself traces itself back to Judaism. So, how's that make you feel? Who's the hypocrite now? God love you. You know Jesus does.